Hopefully you guys can hear me over the raindrops. I'm here in the car just taking my break. Uh, trying to refuel. I uh, wish we can get rain at least here in Central Cal at least once a week. That would be awesome, you know, during certain times of the year. But uh, I'm definitely blessed to get what we have. We are blessed to get what we have. I um, was talking to one of the bread vendors that comes in every so often here at the store. And I don't know if it pertains to the same person he was talking about last week. Because last week he was talking about a certain pastor at the church he attends. Now, he may be talking about somebody different today, but the point of this video is that he was talking about love. And just, he kind of looked like he was down and out. Um, you know, I asked him, you know, how, how he's doing, you know, just trying to... Carry on a bit of a conversation, you know, just a brief conversation, uh, in passing and just whenever I would see him between wrapping meat and setting stuff out. And, you know, he was just talking about loving the unlovable and how it's hard for him and how, you know, he, he wants to, you know, we're the salt of the earth and, and he realizes that. We're the salt of the earth. We're supposed to be flavorful. We're supposed to love the unlovable. And that can be a hard thing. A very hard thing. You know, uh, in times past, you know, thinking about unloving the unlovable, I would just ignore the situation and just, you know, is it... I'm going to try not to use that word a whole lot. Seems to be my uh, slogan. <laughs> um, I told him to read Corinthians 13, chapter 13. It's all about love. Basically, paraphrasing, without love, without practicing love, your faith, your hope, everything is in vain. It's all for nothing you can't love somebody else if you can't love the unlovable because we're all made in the image of God and if you're not loving your brother if you're not loving your sister you're not loving God either um, I believe I have a video that pertains to the image of God uh, you'll have to look that up in the uh, playlist um, well it would be under scripture but uh, I believe that might be the title of the video. But I, you know, asked him, well, have you uh, fasted? He said it's been a while, you know, since he has fasted. And it looked like he might give that some consideration on fasting and inquiring of the Lord. But uh, I felt the Holy Spirit tell me to tell him, read Corinthians chapter 13. And if you guys find yourself in the same situation with not being able to love the lovable, you know, maybe somebody that has wronged you, somebody that has done something wrong, somebody that has borrowed money from you and not paid you a cent. Somebody that has just spoken unkind words to you or been rude to you we gotta forgive we forgive and then we can move on because if you don't forgive that's that's something you're still thinking about but all right guys i just wanted to uh hop on here really quick uh like and subscribe for more content, click that notification bell, and I will see you guys there.